Hi there, Cancer, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of June the 3rd through to the 9th. I went ahead, shuffled the cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Cancer. First up, we have the Two of Wands in the upright, followed then by Major Arcana, the Tower reversed. Next, we have the Six of Pentacles in the upright, followed then by Major Arcana, the Star in the upright. And lastly, we have the Two of Wands. Your overall energy is the, or sorry, Two of Swords, the Two of Wands is your overall energy here, Cancer. And this is a little bit like having one foot in the past, one foot in the future, but being way more future focused. This is where you're, you're looking at where you desire to go. I mean, this character is holding a globe in their head. It could be that some of you are desiring to make a major move. It could be to move uh, to the next state. It could be to move across town. It could be to move to another country across water. Others of you are just sort of in that state of flux where you're just not sure whether you want to move forward or you want to stay put where you are. Could be in a career or job decision or something like that. But you are more focused on the future than you are on the present and the past right now. That's what it looks like, at least for this week. Right at the beginning of the week, you have the tower in the reverse position. This is a situation that could have gone off the rails. Tower in the upright position is something that could have gone drastically wrong. It could be could be a chaos that comes out of nowhere. It could be, um, you know, something going wrong with your home or your vehicle, your foundation, something like that. And you just didn't see it coming. It comes out of the blue. <clears throat> it could be a, a situation with a relationship. It could be a situation with your family, with your neighborhood friends, anything like that, work and career. When the card is inverted, however, this is where the threat passes you by, disaster is averted. So lovely energy. Now, why that happened, we don't know, at least yet. <laughs> Next card up is the Six of Pentacles in the upright position. This is the equal work for equal pay type of energy. This is also uh, the card that represents generosity. It's a big yes if any of you are looking to uh, maybe obtain a loan. For some of you, this could be a financial situation. Maybe you want to move somewhere or do something and um, you decide to go and say get a loan or get something else that's going to take you away from the danger or the chaos. And it could be a reach out somebody's able to help you. Now this could be a friend, a family member. This could also be the bank um, that approves a loan or a mortgage for you. And that could be what's diverting, overting, or that's how you divert this disaster. Others of you, this could be um, somebody else maybe. You're the one who's sort of saving the day for somebody else. You're helping them with your generosity. Sometimes it could be generosity in spirit as well. It doesn't necessarily have to be about finances, although it could be it is pentacles. But this could be you maybe stepping in and, and saving. So it could be your your uh, child, your grown child or something like that. It could be that you step in and you stop it. And it could be because of your generosity and maybe your safe for example, maybe your grown son or daughter is living in an unsafe situation and uh, they want to move, but they don't have the money. Maybe this is you helping them to do that. So yeah, there could be that. Let us know in the comment section if these readings are resonating for you and do tell us how so. <laughs> Moving on towards the weekend, this is the Aquarius energy of the star in the upright position. Wish upon a star this week. Um, uh, cancer because you're feeling optimism and hope in this uh, time frame for some reason. It could be because you were able to save the day for yourself or for somebody else and you're just having that feeling. That's that inner knowing, that faith that just comes from within where you just know, you just sense that everything's going to be all right. So it's a warm and fuzzy kind of feeling. Like I said, it's also the wish card, wish upon a star. This is the major arcana's version of the wish card. But something is giving you that hope and optimism. It could be because of this um, generosity situation. It could be that maybe for you, you wanted to move or you wanted to change jobs or something like that. But finances sort of stood in the way. 
now you have it available to you so you're feeling more optimistic now at the end of the week here we are with the two of swords in the upright position this is about needing to make a decision but we don't know whether to go right or to go left because we feel we don't have enough information in order to make that decision remember your overall was caught between the past and the future this looks like well now that you're in a position to be able to move on what do you do you could be left with this little dilemma at the end of the week i hate to leave you with a cliffhanger but you're going to have to let us know in the comments section below how this turned out but this is about needing to make a decision but you're kind of feeling a little bit stuck because it's like i need a little bit more information before i move forward right Looks like an interesting week for you here, Cancer. So that's what I have for you. Let's uh, pull a Wisdom card from the Wisdom Oracle deck. See what your Wisdom card is for the week here, Cancer. What do we have for Cancer? We have To Be Fair. Hmm. Interesting. To Be Fair, number 38. So could be that's what you're weighing out here maybe it's like you know i want to do something or i want to make this change but i don't know if it's the right thing to do i don't know if it's you know the fair thing to do so that's what i have for you i hope you have a fabulous week thanks so much for joining me and i really hope the reading helped you if it did please feel free to like share and subscribe and i will see you again in the next video take care much love namaste bye bye for now